Ugh, looking for a job is not easy. I need to start paying and stuff like that. Like, I tried looking for several jobs, and not a lot of jobs are looking to hire. This is so annoying. Wait, what's this? <gasps> There's a restaurant job. Oh my god, they're hiring. Oh my god. This is perfect. This is exactly what I need I'm just a little bit stressed out right now because I need money Ugh, they, Please, please, please. I hope they hire me. All right, I'm gonna put in my resume and everything is checked. Okay, perfect All right, they should call me back soon I hope they call me back because all the other jobs they have not called me back and this is becoming into a real problem Alrighty, what else am I gonna do? Phantom! Phantom! Who in their right mind is trying to ruin my beauty sleep? Even though I'm not really sleeping, I'm looking for a job. I don't know anyone around here. Oh, wait a minute. It's, it's probably one of my good friends. What is he doing here? Let me go get the door. Uh, David, what the hell are you doing here? Open the door! Did you forget? It's vacation day! We're going to Barry Avenue! Oh! Oh my god! I forgot! We are supposed to go to Barry Avenue! <gasps> oh my god, I've been so stressed out with money that I haven't even remembered that we're supposed to go on our bestie vacation! <laughs> Relax, I got you a good deal, even though the deal sucks. Oh, well then if it sucks, then I'm not gonna go. Phantom, you're going to go! Uh, <laughs> David, why are you looking at me like that? <laughs> please, please, no! Alrighty, passengers, make sure to get ready to be scanned. Make sure to take off your jewelry so it does not get mistaken for any weapons. And don't bother to run away from me if you have no money, because I will catch you. Oh my god, Nova! Why are you here? You're like everywhere, I swear. You know what? I'm not even gonna be surprised where you're gonna be working next. Honestly, you're just like the lady that always works everywhere. Chill out, bro. Let's just get our stuff in. Ugh, he's right. I should just put my stuff away and let's go. Whoa, who's that guy? He looks so good. Oh, and he's going to Barry Avenue too? Looking like I'm gonna have to go there myself. <laughs> Listen, Elena, I'm not going back to work today, okay? I am going to give myself some time off. No, I am not seeing other people. Elena, I need you to relax. I am not bind by you. Yes, it was an arranged marriage. It doesn't need it doesn't mean anything. I'm not gonna be with you. I, I have to go. I, I got myself into a really crummy ticket and I don't even know what's gonna happen. So I'm gonna I'm gonna let you go. Alright, bye. Goodbye. <sighs> Why am I stuck in this arranged marriage with her? I do not need to be there. If only I could find somebody, then maybe I can get out of it. Whatever, I'm just gonna go on to this vacation. I know it was last minute, but I needed to take some time off for myself. I know I got some emails for my job that people are trying to look for a job or something like that, but I'll deal with that later when I come back. Alrighty, all passengers are in. It's time to fly then. All right, passengers, go have a seat and hurry up. Um, before the plane starts and drops you all. Ugh, Nova doesn't have to be so rude. We'll be sitting, okay? Um, bro, can't you, like, move? You're not Windex or anything. Like, I need you to kind of step aside. Ah, that is so disrespectful! Ugh, whatever. All right, it's time to find my seat. Oh my god, this guy, again. Bro, you're sitting on my seat. Oh, well, I didn't know I was sitting in your seat. I just like the window seat, okay? Do you not know how tickets work? You need to get off. That's my seat. Oh my god, you need to take a chill pill. You are so disgustingly rude. Ugh, fine. Take your stupid seat. Stupid guy. Ugh, this is gonna be a long flight. Whatever. Ugh, I just need to get out of this place and just take some time for myself. So, uh, since we're sitting here for the next eight hours, how are you doing today, sitting partner? Please don't talk to me. I don't want to talk to anybody right now. Ew, well, whatever. I don't want to talk to you either. You're so phony. Ugh, whatever. How did I get stuck with this idiot? Excuse me, don't be calling me an idiot. How did I get stuck with you? Ah, uh, this is the life. Ugh, I'm so jealous. I wish I was with that guy. Ugh, finally some snacks. <laughs> no, Phantom, this isn't for you. It's for me, you babbling idiot. Uh, excuse me? What do you mean for who? Why don't I get food? You didn't pay for it on your ticket. But you know what? I feel bad for you, so if anything, I'll get you crackers instead. David! What kind of tickets did you get me? These tickets suck! I told you the deal sucked. Ugh, yeah, but I thought you were just saying that. Ugh, fine. So, I'll take the crackers. Uh, ugh, this is gonna be a long, long ride. Like, this guy is so loud and obnoxious. 
All he does is complain. Ugh, I can't take it. Get me off this plane. Now, you know how I feel when I'm with Phantom. I heard that, Nova. I heard that. All right, we're finally here. Oh my God, thank God. Oh my God, this place is so nice. It's so lovely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Blondie, you have to separate room with someone else. As for you, Phantom, you're sharing the room with Justin. Wait, what do you mean we got separate rooms? What? We're supposed to be in the same room. What did you do, David? And who the hell is Justin? Wait, what? I'm sharing the room with Mr. Loudmouth? Are you kidding me? No, 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 no. There has to be some type of mistake. Listen. I already had the worst time sharing my seat with this guy over here. Can you please give me something separate, please? Um, excuse me. I am not loud. And on top of that, it's not my fault that I'm sassy, okay? That's just how I am. You do not have to be so rude. If anything, Nova changed me to another room because I don't want to be next to this guy. Help me, Nova. Okay, I'm not going to repeat myself. Oh, oh my God. Girl, it is not that deep. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, all right, you don't have to point that gun, miss. You're both stuck together, okay? So suck it up. That's what the ticket said. I'm not changing it because it takes 10 years to do it. So you're gonna deal with it. Wait, I'll stay with him. Huh? Oh no, do not put me next to that room in that guy. Uh-oh, please. Okay, I'll, I'll go, I'll go, I'll go, I'll go. Jesus Christ, this sucks. This is gonna be fun. <sighs> what did I get myself into? I know it was like last minute, but I should have been more careful with the tickets that I bought. It's not like I can't afford it. Whatever, I gotta keep my cover low anyways. Alrighty guys, enjoy y'all rooms and do not change into other rooms or else you are banned from this establishment. You hear me? Oh my god, you don't have to be so harsh. Ugh, fine, whatever. Anything you do outside of this hotel is none of my concern. But here, do anything funny and you're getting arrested. Okay, alright, we get it. You can put the gun away. Jesus Christ. Enjoy! What kind of headache did I get myself into? All right, guys, I'm gonna go get some rest so that I can get ready for today. If you want, I can stay with you. Are you crazy? Nova said no, that we can't do things like that. Uh-uh, I am not trying to get in trouble. You're trying to get me kicked out. Goodbye. I will get what I came for. Ugh, that guy was so weird. Anyways, wow, this place is so nice. Oh my God, look at everything. This is such a beautiful place. Yeah, I kind of need you not to talk to me, okay? Ugh, can't believe I'm stuck here with this guy. Ugh, I'm just gonna be here and lay down for a moment. How am I supposed to get out of trouble? Ugh, honestly, how did I get myself stuck with this? This is such a bad vacation already. I'm already having trouble getting hired, and now I'm stuck with this idiot that does not show any manners. He's rude. Ugh, whatever. I'm not gonna let him ruin my parade. I'm gonna go get ready for today, hang out with my bestie, and not even think about it. That guy can sit by himself with his own misery. Ugh, all right, whatever. Anyways, you know what? I'm gonna leave him some food, because I already ordered my food, so I don't know what he likes, but I'll leave it to him just to be nice. You know what? Maybe I was being a little bit too mean with that guy. I get it. I got things that's going on. <sighs> I, just, I, just, I just get annoyed really quickly. Let me see if there's any food outside. Hmm? What's this? He left me food? Oh, wait. He left a letter as well. Dear Mr. Justin, here's some food, you grumpy old fart. Stop being angry, and I hope you feel better. I'm not an old fart, first of all. I'm not even that old. And secondly, his name is Phantom, huh? Ugh, whatever. Now I feel like I have to thank him later. Well, uh, I might as well just eat and just, you know, walk around the city and check it out. <gasps> oh my god! So this is Barry Avenue? Everything looks so nice and it's so warm here! Look at the view! Look at the beach! Look at all the stores! Uh, it's so warm in here! You know what? I know that I'm having trouble trying to find a job, but I definitely needed a vacation to just step away and just kind of get some air. Thanks, bud. I appreciate that. I'm telling you, this is exactly what you needed. Yeah, you're right. I'm so happy that we got here. The beach looks way awesome. Alrighty, I'm gonna go check out all the other stores. You can have some fun at the beach. Oh no, I'm gonna check out other stores too, but you go enjoy yourself. Oh my God, there's so much to do. I can't wait. Hmm, this isn't really my style, but I mean, it'll take some time away. I should probably go get some coffee soon. Coffee sounds nice about now. Ugh, my stupid arranged girlfriend is calling me. I don't even wanna be with her. Uh, I need to find a way not to be with her. Anyways, I'm by the coffee shop. I don't have time to deal with this. Hi, can I get a caramel macchiato ice plate? Aren't you that lady that works in the hotel and in the airport? Don't ask. I'll get you what you need. Ugh, whatever. This trip is getting weirder and weirder by the minute. Hmm, 
Hmm, this must be the coffee shop that people were talking about. I'm gonna go ahead and check it out because I'm kind of thirsty. Oh my god, I am totally in the mood for ice caramel macchiato! Oh, it looks like I'm next. Oh, hi Nova, I didn't know you were working here. Actually, I did because I wasn't even surprised. Anyways, can I get an ice caramel macchiato please and thank you? Sure, that'll be $20. Nova, it literally says that it's $10. Where are you getting 20? Rats! I forgot to change the sign. <sighs> okay, whatever. I'll get you your stupid coffee. Nova, what are we gonna do with you? Ugh, whatever. Wait, isn't that my roommate? Phantom was it, I think? Oh god. It's, uh, Justin, I think that was his name? I hope he doesn't say anything. I try to get him food and be nice. It's kinda awkward because he's just kinda staring at me. Hmm, maybe I should say sorry about earlier. You know what? I'm gonna do it. Hey, you're Phantom, right? So I wanted to say, Yo, let me take you out to dinner, hot legs. Uh, I hope that guy isn't like talking to me. Yeah, I'm talking to you, guy with the mask and a blue shirt. Uh-oh, yeah, he's definitely talking to me. Listen, <laughs> I've noticed that you've been kind of following me around. Is it okay if you could, oh, I don't know, give me some space? I'm not really looking for anyone at the moment. I'm just taking some time for myself, you know, like some self-clearance. I don't need um anyone to get me anything, and I'm good. Thank you. Please leave me alone. Oh, so you like to play hard to get, huh? No, I'm not insinuating anything. I just want you to leave me alone. Please, you're, you're bothering me. You're harassing me. Come on, I have my car with me. Let's go. Um, no, I said... Bro, is there, like, a problem? Do you, do you have trouble hearing? Are you deaf or something? He said he's not interested. How about you back up? Oh, look who's over here, Mr. Tough Guy. He said he's not interested. Do you not understand, or do you want my fist to do something about it? <gasps> oh, my God, that is so nice of him. Yeah, like what he said. A freeze, you're under arrest. Oh, uh, I was just kidding. I, I didn't mean to harm anyone. Uh, uh, look at the time. I gotta go. And don't come back to the hotel! Ugh, they don't pay me enough for this. Uh, uh, are you okay, Phantom? Yeah, yeah, no, I'm fine. Thank you so much for, for saving me. And listen, I'm sorry if I've been causing you trouble. I, I didn't mean to, you know, but thank you for saving me back there. Ugh, it's whatever, just, you know, try, try to, like, get yourself out of trouble, okay? I know you couldn't help it, but, you know, just, just try to do that. And thanks for the food, all right? But just make sure to ask me next time and yeah, whatever. Anyways, I, I gotta go. I don't have time for this, but just stay out of trouble. Uh, okay, yeah, thanks. Three days later. Well, today is my last day in Barry Avenue. I mean, it was nice here. I definitely want to come back. But that guy didn't really talk much. All he kept doing, he kept locking himself into the room or he'll just go out without warning. Eh, whatever. Today's my last day. I don't got anything to worry about. <sighs> Time to get, eat all this food and then go back to Brookhaven. Stop avoiding me. You already went on that stupid trip. Now answer me. I don't have to answer to anything, okay? Listen, you are so... <sighs> okay, I think I'm here. I'm so happy that this job finally called me. Oh, this is gonna be so exciting. I'm gonna ace that interview. Wait a minute, that guy looks familiar. Wait, are you kidding me? Is that the guy that I'm supposed to interview? Um, do you like know him or something? Yeah, uh, I know him. That's my boyfriend. Wait, what? <laughs> 